Nathan? Yeah. Land ho. Pretty cool. Take the wheel for a second. All this running around, surviving by the skin of our teeth. I think we've actually taken a moment to step back and appreciate just how far we've come. Huh? Sick Parvis Magna. Sick Parvis Magna. Yeah. Listen, little brother. She will get over it. I mean, we bring back a treasure like that, anyone would. I don't know. Maybe I've uh, done this one too many times. Somehow I imagined it bigger. Yeah, well, we're definitely in the right place. We'll find us a spot to set ashore. Oh, well, I mean, at least there's an island, right? <laughs> yeah, at least there's an island. Just keep an eye out for anything man made. Ah, you mean pirate made? <laughs> sure. So, maybe Libertalia is more of a small beachside shack. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a tree house. <laughs> or maybe Avery spent his entire fortune setting up this treasure hunt and ran out of money to actually build Libertalia. Yeah. Hey, what if he did run out of money? Then both of us better find a place to hide. You know, crazy worldwide treasure on his side. Maybe we had the right idea. What's that? Lived by his own rules, traveled the world, made his fortune his way. Yeah, sure. Depart from the huge bounty on his head. Come on. It all depends on how his story ends, right? Who knows? Maybe in the end it was all worth it. Over there, it's a ship. Oh, it's left of one. Marco! Marco what?
Marco! Forget it. this Did you find anything? Yeah. 400 million in muggle treasure. Ha ha ha, cute. Strange feeling. Like we're finally on the verge of something really great, and I'm... Excited and terrified all at once. You have any idea what I'm talking about? I do. And let's check this out. Sounds good to me. Might not be Libertalia. The shore is gorgeous here, though. No argument there. Wet socks will keep you cool. Come on. All right, we're done here. I'm with you. Come <laughs> on. 
want to rejoin our little adventure? Hey, check it out. Dolphin. Yeah, you've seen dolphins before, right? Yeah, I have, but many, many, many years ago. You'd be happy to know they haven't changed much. Hey, Nathan, we're straying a bit here. Oh, are we? And take a look around. You want to come? Of course I want to come. <laughs> Supplies from an earlier expedition. Huh. Okay. What do you got there? Burns. Holy crap, Sam, this was written by Burns' grandson. Well, it makes sense. The cross in Panama was hollow. Must be following the same clues as us. And that must have been their ship by the reef. Well, it makes sense. 
wonder what this guy's story was. Huh? Dead men tell no tales. Come on, shipping out. Yeah, I'll come. Nathan, up there. Well, that definitely qualifies as man made. Uh huh. Pirate made. Let's find a way up to that tower. Yeah. <clears throat> Over here, stairs. Whoa, wonder what this guy did. Uh, well, maybe he wouldn't stop singing in the sea shanties. Yeah, that's probably it. Small cave here. It's like an old lookout tower. Well, let's see if we can spot something from up there. Okay, up we go. Sam, this way. Looks promising.
Some kind of symbol. Looks like a compass arrow. <laughs> How did you know to do that? Well, there's one thing I've learned from you. Press everything. <laughs> Down there, the same symbol. Another arrow. Let's go find out where it's pointing, huh? Come on. Well, it's right below us. Yep. Huh. It's a door of some kind. <clears throat> Covering a chamber? A massive chamber. For storing a bunch of treasure? No way. Not with his ego. Wherever Avery put the treasure is gonna be the most elaborate place we've seen yet. And it would be well protected, too. That makes sense. <clears throat> Let's follow these arrows, see where they go. Time to go. Yeah. All right. Keep your shirt on. Hey, look. Another arrow over there. 